the topic for this video is shift micro operations now what are shift micro operations used for they are basically used for serial transfer of data which can be done in both the directions left or right now basically when there is a shift left operation the input transfers a bit into the rightmost position and vice versa let's see shift micro operations in detail there are three types of shift micro operation which can be logical circular and arithmetic firstly what are logic shift micro operations it is the easiest to perform as the bits are simply shifted to the left or to the right firstly how it is represented s h r s h l this is for shift right for shift left and the registers or the register which has to be shifted now in this particular logic shift micro operation what is done is whenever if it is the shift left a zero is transferred at the rightward position and the leftmost bit is lost that is if we have a register like this and we have to perform the left logic shift what is done the content of this this bit is shifted to this this is shifted to this this is shifted to this and so on this particular is because shifted here and his hands lost and this last bit is padded with zero similarly in the case of logic shift right the leftmost bit is added with zero and the rightmost bit is lost therefore there is a disadvantage in this logic shift micro operations that there is loss of information now let's come to circular micro operation in this firstly it is also known as rotate operation the advantage in this is that the information is not lost in the left shift circular shift the bits are shifted in the left direction and the rightmost bit takes the left position for example if this is a register this content if we do a left shift this content is not lost it will be added to this rightmost position hence there is no loss of information in this particular shift micro operation now also this is represented by cil or cir this is for left this is for right circular left and circular right shift micro operations last is arithmetic shift micro operations which is basically a micro operation that shifts a signed binary number to the left or right it is represented by a s h r a s h r with the register that has to be shifted firstly in this case we consider the sign bit also because the arithmetic shift requires that the sign bit remains unchanged as you all know zero is the bit for positive number and one is the bit for negative number now considering an example if we have a register like this b not b n minus 1 b n minus 2 and this is the sign bit in case of arithmetic shift at right arithmetic shift right that means every bit has to be shifted right side what we have to do is the sign bit will remain unchanged and we will shift the number including the sign bit what does that mean is bn minus 1 will become here bn minus will remain here but b not value will be lost because every bit will be shifted but in the case of left arithmetic shift left the b not position which was earlier b not here zero is added and all the other bits are shifted to the left the initial bit which was bn minus 1 is lost in this case 
this is the right one this is the left one here the sine bit remains unchanged but in this case bn minus 1 that is the sine bit will be lost and this bn minus 2 will be shifted here now one fact to be remembered is if in this case left arithmetic shift micro operation if the sign bit changes that means if it was 1 and after transfer after shifting it changes to 0 that means or vice versa that means there is an overflow condition right now coming to the hardware implementation of this particular micro operations let's consider the truth table first in this case the hardware implementation requires mux of 2 cross 1 that means the select line that we need is only 1 okay that can be either 0 or 1 this is output 0, output 1, output 2, output 3. According to our diagram, what we are considering is 0 is for right, 1 is for left. Now, if this is a number, register I0, I1, I2, and I3, see output 0, output 1, output 2, output 3. Now, after right shift, this will be shifted here this will be shifted here this will be shifted here and i3 will be lost for right output 3 will have input 2 output 3 will have input 2 similarly output 2 will have input 1 this will have input 0 and this will have the padding of 0 or the sign or the bit for right shift similarly in this case it will be i1 I2, I3 and left shift. Now seeing this true table, we will make a diagram which will have 4 multiplexers. Select line 0, 1, select line 0, 1, select line 0, 1, select line 0, 1. Every max will give shift for individual bit now according to this truth table we have select line which can either be 0 or 1 select lines right this select line will enter every multiplexer like this now we have 4 inputs looking at this output 0 has SR and I1 that means we have one SR that is serial input for right shift. Similarly, one SL for left shift. Now, output 0 SR is entering and I1 is entering. SR will be entering at 0 and I1 will be entering at 1. Similarly, in output 1, I0 is entering at 0 and i2 is entering at 1 in output 2 out input 1 is entering at 0 and in input 3 is input at 1 and output 3 input 2 is entering at 0 and sl is entering at input 1 and this completes your hardware implementation of the shift micro operations thank you